guys, this is Dan from CareStream. Uh, real quick, I'm going to show you how to use the CS Adapt filters for the panoramic images uh, taken with the CS9300, CS8100, and CS8100 3D, and uh, the CS9000 and CS9000 3D. Uh, once we get our panoramic images taken, uh, as you can see here, we've got the uh, dental imaging software. It's going to be a little bit different in WinOMS imaging and the imaging software from OrthoTrack. Uh, but in dental imaging software, once we have the panoramic up, um, we will have our control panel here. Um, some of you guys might have this going on. Um, click on our up button. That'll bring up the full display. We should have a zero, one, and two located. Those are our preset adapt filters. And I've got mine set up uh, in a certain way. Um, but if, say, we wanted to change one of these, we're going to click on our little star with the gear. That's going to launch CS Adapt. Once CS Adapt is launched, we're going to choose the image that we want to modify. In this case, we're going to click on Modify Favorite. Uh, we've got, uh, if we use our mouse wheel, we can scroll up and down and actually take a look at all the filters that we have available. And we, if we hover over those images, it's going to give us a quick snapshot of what that looks like. So. And then if we want to save those in that spot, what we're going to do is we're going to click on the favorite button. And then that is saved as favorite in option zero in the imaging software. Uh, we can also further customize those if we want to. Um, we won't go over that today. That's something if you'd like to play around with it, you're welcome to do that. Um, but once we get that saved, we can go to back to overview. We can select a different one if we want to. Or if we're done, we can save and exit. You can also just exit out using the uh, red X, and that will do the same thing as well. So that's saved now as your favorite. And uh, again, you can go through and uh, cycle through um, which, whichever one that you want to see. I uh, hope this helps, guys. Let me know if you have any questions.